Hi, this is Music and Message, and this is Let Your Light Shine Down. Night after night, hey, without a sound, I may fall, but through it all, as you come back around, you lift me up in the morning, and as the heavens proclaim your glory, well, I know I'm heaven bound, tear down the veil. Let your light shine down Open the windows of heaven As the sun comes back around Oh, Jesus, your love, it never fails As the whole world lets me down Tear down the veil Let your light shine, your light shine Your light shine down it is finished, you said, and forever it was done. Now it's by grace and by faith that the victory is won. And you still show up for me, hey, you're still the one whose glory goes before me, and it's only just begun. Tear down the veil. Let your light shine down Open the windows of heaven As the sun comes back around Oh, Jesus, your love, it never fails The whole world lets me down Tear down the veil Let your light shine, your light shine Your light shine down death and resurrection to glorify your name lead in the right direction let the whole world praise Jesus the Lord of all the Lord of all creation all the Lord of all the Lord of all creation Let your light shine down Open the windows of heaven As the sun comes back around And Jesus, your love, it never fails As the whole world let down Tear down the veil Let your light shine, your light shine Your light shine down Tear down the veil Let your light shine down. I was out in Wyoming with the family on vacation. And from there we wandered into Yellowstone Park. And I remember a waterfall sprinkling mist down through the pine trees and the sun shining through, creating a rainbow 
and a cool breeze so delicate that you could almost feel the light. And then in Indiana, coming home, late at night after a hard day's work, across the expanse, the flatland, and farm fields, sun drifts down to the western horizon, and the awesome display of color changing minute by minute is more than any artist could ever depict on canvas. The heavens declare the glory of God. And there is no speech or language where his voice is not heard. Light intermingled with creation positioned in such a way as to be a masterpiece. Point us to a home. Heavenward? Heavenward. Some of us see the light. And maybe it's shining too bright in our eyes. Or being awake is too uncomfortable. For whatever reason, some people go back into the dark. I have friends that don't even want to drive by their trouble spots on the way home because they don't want to be around the persons, places, and things that have gotten them into trouble before. To step backward for a believer and relapse is human. But it doesn't have to be this way. It's, it opens us up to more suffering than is necessary, and there's a softer, easier way. Nobody is perfect. Nobody does life completely right. I haven't done life completely right. It's certainly by faith that we're all going to be saved, not by works. The only person that did it right was Jesus, who loves us, died for us, was buried, crucified, was buried, rose again, back to life, showing us the way out of this world alive. Accessing that power of resurrection, staying close to Christ and his people can keep us from falling backwards. It, it, and it is the easier, softer way. Look at what the Lord went through, his sacrifice for us on the cross. It was very costly. And look at how all of creation responded when he died on the cross. Reading now in Matthew 27, Jesus, when he had cried again with a loud voice, yielded up the ghost. And behold, the veil of the temple was rent in twain from the top to the bottom, and the earth did quake, and the rocks rent, and the graves were opened. And many of the bodies of the saints which slept arose and came out of the grave after his resurrection and went into the holy city and appeared unto many, now in the centurion. And they that were with him, watching Jesus, saw the earthquake and those things that were done, they feared greatly, saying, Truly this was the Son of God. Matthew 27, 50 through 54. One way to keep what I have, what we have, is to give it away. No man, when he had lighted a candle, cover it with a vessel, or put it under a bed, but sets it on a candlestick, that they which enter in may see the light. That's in Luke 8. 16 through 18, and Jesus said, you're the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill cannot be hid. Matthew 5, 14, Jesus also made it clear who he was. He said, I am the light of the world. Jesus said, I am the light of the world. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. John 8, 12. I asked Jesus to come into my life and work in me and through me. And that has made all the difference. And I keep trying to give it away and stay close to him by reading scripture every day and getting together regularly in meetings with his people. There used to be a veil that separated people from the holiest of holy. But after Jesus' crucifixion, that veil was divinely torn from top to bottom giving us access to God directly through prayer. Because the church down here will soon be the church up there in heaven. And God blesses what we do down here. If we have, if we have to give up something or someone for the kingdom, he replaces it a hundredfold. 
if we have to give up something or someone for the kingdom, he replaces it a hundredfold. Say that again. And everything that we do in the right way, even if we give a cold drink of water to a child, he rewards it. It all comes back to us eventually. We have an awesome, loving, merciful, kind, caring Savior who gives the str gives us strength to keep coming back. And His power of resurrection in this lifetime, and it's for this lifetime and the world beyond. He wants the best things for us. He wants to bless us and keep us from harm and from falling backwards. Yeah, it's by grace and faith that we're saved, not by works, but he rewards what we do for him and can make us and keep us content. It's not what goes into, by the way, it's not what goes into someone that defiles them, it's what comes out. So, if you cannot do or say the right thing, doing what you do, then what you're doing isn't working. It's not working. God can make us and keep us content. This heavenly home that's being built for us, this hope, joy, peace, is available for all of us. As we invite the living Christ to come into our lives, work in us and through us, and hold fast in faith. My prayer is, my prayer is for peace, mercy, healing, restoration of anything lost and blessing above and beyond come to jesus he says all you who are heavy laden and i will give you rest what we have is joy peace forgiveness forgiveness How about waking up with purpose and without shame? May God show you his light and let the light shine down. Tear down the veil, let your light shine down. Open the windows of heaven as the sun comes back around Jesus you love it never fails the whole world lets me down tear down the veil let your light shine your light shine your light shine down let your light shine your light shine down this has been music and message. This has been Let Your Light Shine Down. Now have a wonderful week.